so Nintendo Direct rumors have been running rampant this past week. Mostly thanks to Giant Bomb's Jeff Grubb, who said on his podcast with Mike Minotti that their certain Wind Waker and Twilight Princess Switch ports will be announced in the next Nintendo Direct this month, along with maybe the Metroid Prime Remaster. Well, yesterday, Grubb appeared on the Nintendo Shack podcast, link to it in the description, to double down on his original comments while adding some new ones, saying that we'll also probably get the name of Breath of the Wild 2, along with the Wii U HD transfers of Wind Waker and Twilight Princess. The Metroid Prime Remaster is supposed to come out this holiday as well, so we should be seeing that in this Direct too. He mentioned that these are a lot of GameCube remasters, but it's unclear if Nintendo will theme the Direct around them. He also claimed that It Takes Two will be coming to Switch and will be announced in this Direct. This isn't the first we've heard of this rumored port, as this has also been claimed from a leaker called The Snitch on Discord, who previously leaked the entirety of the PlayStation third-party showcase back in June. Circling back to Grubb's claims, he also mentioned that Nintendo's been holding on to so much of this stuff for so long, even saying that the rumored Fire Emblem game is sitting at Nintendo HQ, ready to be released. Hopefully what Grubb's saying is true, and this next to direct is a blowout of GameCube remasters. After all, insider Liam Robertson said that GameCube Nation's gonna be winning this month, with insider Direct Feed Games responding with a cheeky tease at an F-Zero GX remaster. Although Robertson didn't exactly corroborate that. However, Emily Rogers said on Fama boards that Nintendo was going crazy with remasters and remakes, so maybe this could be the beginning of a slew of re-releases from Nintendo, starting with GameCube games. But that's not all, as leaker Zippo posted on their blog that a new 2D Mario game is in development, though they don't say anything about it being in the next Nintendo Direct but it is set to be released either in 2023 or 2024. Zippo said that this 2D Mario will be its own thing, with the new Super moniker being thankfully retired. It'll feature a new art style that'll take some people by surprise, it's very far along in development, and it'll include online multiplayer and the return of Foreman Spike. They guess that it'll release sometime around the Super Mario Bros. movie in April next year, but they emphasize that this is just a guess. Assuming this rumor is true, it'll be nice to see a new 2D Mario game that does its own thing instead of continuing the new Super series. Zippo has had some accurate claims in the past, successfully predicting Mario Party Superstars and Metroid Dread being announced at E3 2021, but we still have yet to hear about the new Donkey Kong game from the Mario Odyssey team that they claimed last year was happening. So we'll have to wait and see if this new 2D Mario is real. But that's all for this rumor roundup here on Game Explain. Let us know what you think of all these rumors in the comments below. Do you believe them? Do you not believe them? And be sure to check out the videos on the right for more topics you might be interested in. Until next time, bye.